that a commercial bank has is holding 10 million CDs in government paper. And bear in mind that the commercial banks are holding much larger sums. They are one of the biggest holders of government bonds at the moment. So a commercial bank is holding 10 million CDs. That money is not its own money. That's actually depositors' money that it has invested in what it thought was prudent and wise, safe investment. If that bank has a weighted average cost today of deposits of about, say, 15%, then that bank is paying 15% of the 10 million, right? Which is now, for argument's sake, 1.5 million that it's going to have to give to its depositors for this 10 million. Now, if this is rolled over to the bond, any category of the four bonds, and it earns absolutely no money next year, this bank is paying 1.5 million CDs in costs and getting zero in revenue. So